So you've downloaded the new in-painting weights from Runway ML and you're thinking to yourself, I wonder if these in-painting weights are any good at out-painting. Well, let's find out, shall we? Okay, so here we are. I've got the standard 1.5 EMA only pruned checkpoint. Just to start with, this is something that we can compare with. We've just generated a cat there, so a fantasy art painting of a cat. Let's send this over to image to image and activate this outpainting mark two. Great. So we've got outpainting mark two. Are we going to change any of these configuration options? Uh, yes, we are. I'm going to change the denoising strength. Just going to put that to maximum, but I'm going to ignore the rest of the settings there. It recommends using a high number of steps, but I'm doing this quickly because I like living on the very edge of the precipice itself, teetering on the... Uh... Anyway, so there we have all the default settings. Not going to bother changing any of those. Everything else is exactly the same. So let's let's find out what happens. I'm just going to change the prompt as well. So now I've got a fantasy art painting of a cyberpunk room because I've got my cat. I just want to put my cat inside a room. Let's click that generate button and see how well the default 1.5 pruned EMA checkpoints do on out painting with all those fairly standard settings. Will it be a good picture? Will it be a bad picture? I don't know. Judge for yourself. There you go. There is the cat with the room, little bit of out painting. Now I know obviously you're meant to up the steps, but I'm testing things here, remember? I'm testing, precipice, testing. Okay, so let's have a look at the 1.4 weights as well. Let's see how well 1.4 does. Will it generate the same sort of thing? We've got the cyberpunk room that we're putting into the mask around there. Will it be the same? Will it be better than 1.5? I don't know. It's, it's, it's still generating. Place your bets, please. Place your bets. Will it be better? Will it be worse? It's very, very similar. It is very, very similar. Let's just make that a bit bigger. Still, still very similar. It's a cat in a cyberpunk room. Okay, so let's try the new kid on the block, shall we? Version 1.5 in painting. Now, this will take just a few seconds to load the model. But again, place your bets. Will it be better or worse than that? We've got the cat in the middle there. Fantasy art painting of a cyberpunk room. As you can see there, it's a little bit like you've got the square of the cat and the, the cyberpunk room around the outside of it is, it, it's like an afterthought, isn't it? It's a little bit like an afterthought. But this new checkpoint, the SD 1.5 in painting one, was trained with Whoa. Okay, that's really cool, isn't it? That is really cool. It's kind of carried everything on there and it actually looks like it fits. It, it's, it's coherent and it's consistent and yeah, I think it's safe to say that the, uh, the version 1.5 in-painting checkpoints are very good when it comes to out-painting as well. Of course, if you want to learn even more Nerdy Rodent Geekery, what you can do is click on one of these two videos.